taken them up into one of the top teams in Japan, brought them up from J2, and since then, in that 2009, they've been excellent ever since, and now are bidding to try to make it into the semi-finals of the AFC Champions League for the very first time. But a one goal apiece, Al-Shabaab, they've got the away goal, and that can be so crucial. Yeah. Rafinha. Patience may well be the key word. Rafinha, lovely run. A lovely little chest into the feet of Naif Azazi. Well, there's great defending there by Suzuki. You know, <laughs> even though uh, McNally may have outran him, but, you know, he finally managed to recover in time. Look at that. And Hazazi having a heavy touch there. All Shabab. First corner of the contest from this side, anyway. Atif. Oh, what a header! What a start for Al Shabab, and it's Hazazi. That is a header worthy of winning any game. You can see Michelle, he was uh, smiling there, and he knew that, you know, Hazazi, given a chance like that, he would definitely hit the ball. Like what you said, there's a big centre forward, definitely good with the header. And he's, he definitely scored a superb goal there. Attacks the ball into space, gets ahead of Kim Chang Su. Could this have been, been defended better? Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, because they are men there, and they, I mean, the defender should attack the ball. You see, two men there in between, and Hazazi sneak in between, and what a header there with a powerful textbook header. No chance for the goalkeeper there. Beautiful play. Sets up Rafinha. And Rafinha! Cuts it across goal. Hazazi picks up the second ball. Wow, they're on fire. They've grown into confidence now, you know, after that goal. Into Cleo. His yellow shirt's in the penalty area. Tanaka. There's plenty of yellow shirts in the penalty area. Oh, they've got the equaliser. I think it's off the defender. It looks like uh, Kudo might have got a touch on it. But what a response. They had plenty of shirts in the penalty box. That was the key. And when the cross came in, it was angled, it was flat. And yeah, it's come off Kwak Tehui. But doesn't matter who it's come off, we're all square on the night and all square on aggregate. Oh, yeah, you're right there. So I think Kwak, you know, saw it late and wanted to clear it, but unfortunately cleared it into his own net. But what a good response there by Kashiwa Resol, and the game is open now, again. It was beautiful flowing football from Kashiwa. And Alistar loses out to Hashimoto. Good run by the fullback. How often do we say that about Japanese fullbacks getting forward? Tanaka outside of him. Here is Tanaka, two in the penalty area, one of whom is Cleo! who gets the header in and it's just over the angle. Well, I think, uh, you know, al you know, the fullback is, is guilty of uh, allowing... Uh... Well, the big men are up again, Quack and Hazazi. They scored from the last one. And they nearly scored from this one as well. Super save. But clear. Look at this chance. Oh, what a save. Excellent save there. It's Fernando's header. There's Big Kondo. Wagner's corner met at the far post by Cleo. Good save at his near post by Walid. What a good save there by Walid. You know, he was quick uh, to saw, I mean, to see the ball actually headed by Kondo. Excellent save. Shimoto and Kondo in the box. 
Well, it was um, Suzuki who got that. Well, to be fair, Des, I think both teams uh, have good players that can make good deliveries there, you see. And Suzuki, unfortunately, you know, he couldn't get a clean... Con Super overlap from Kim. Edge of the box, Cleo! Clear chance. What a chance, what a good uh, build-up play there by Kashiwa. I think that was a good knockdown there by Wegner. He saw Cleo was free. And unfortunately the shot went inches wide. But again there's... Torres stands over the ball. Delivery is good. Oh, what a save again. I think it's offside this <laughs> Every time the ball comes into the penalty area, it's causing a problem at either end of the pitch. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna go for a goal So where's the offside? Where's the incident? Well there You think he must be assuming it's It's a knock-on Yep Well defended on the edge of the six-yard box. Wagner dispossessed. Al Jadali. Whoa! I tell you what, that's not a million miles away, is it? <laughs> I don't mind that. That's you know, that was a fantastic shot there. Uh, it's Jadali actually who's come through from the back. Oh yeah, Jadali. Yeah, that was a fantastic shot there. Kim Chang Su. Looks for Cleo! He's put it wide. He's been yeah. taken out by Walid. He was offside anyway. Yeah, he was offside, but I think that was a bad challenge there. I think both uh, players were going for the ball. And Walid, Cleo. Yep. Well, it's a correct call. Definitely a correct call, this. But Walid, if it hasn't been called offside, was a long, long way late. Yes, I think he was definitely uh, way late there in going for the ball. He was very fortunate that he wasn't offside. Rafinha's header, helped on by Torres. Sugeno came out, and Azazi has run into the back of, is it Suzuki? And he's going to pick up a, a yellow card. Actually, it's Kondo who's on the deck. Well, I think he might have injured himself a little bit there with that push. And to be fair, I know you're a centre back and you'll defend Kondo, but Kondo has just stopped. Kondo's literally blocked him off. Yes. What uh, do you expect him to do? Yeah, of course. There's. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I think Kondo was trying to, to protect uh, Haz uh, Haz Hazizi from actually going forward. Uh, but yes, you are right. You know, he. Flag stays down. Head to the box is Hazazi. Hassan continues the run. Hazazi! Nice idea, he was unselfish, looks for Torres. Yeah, it was a great play there. Aziz, uh, Hazazi, Rafinha and Atif. There, Hazazi. Trying to make the pass to Torres, but there was a good uh, clearance there by Kondo. Quack on the edge of the penalty area. Sugano gets a good punch and was caught late. Gave that away, and Hashimoto has got Wagner outside of him. <coughs> <coughs> I 
Wagner, Cleo, oh! It went beyond Cleo to Kudo, and Walid has done brilliantly, both with the scoop and the save, and... What a chance there. Good cross there by Wagner. Yes, Kudo, sneak pass, his marker, and actually there was a good save there by Walid. He was quick enough to react, and managed to get the ball off Cleo. The willing Kudo. Oh, and Cleo couldn't time his run well. It would have been a super one-two goal. What a chance again there by Kashiwa. You see, there was a good cross there by Kudo on rushing uh, Cleo, but unfortunately couldn't get that hitter. He seemed to change his mind yeah. whether to chest it or head it. Leg match now, Rafinha. And they've got a man over, Torres, if he looks to the right, which he has them. He's got Hassan. And Hazaz, he got the shot to be taken by Wagner. Kondo! Now that changes everything. Al Shabab need to. Kondo from the set play. And they've taken those chances. Yes, uh, you know, that, that was a good, great goal there. End to an end, Kashua Resol have made history. They've made it to the quarterfinals. It's the end of the dream for Al Shabab. While Kashua Resol can dream on, they will face Jonbuk Hyundai Motors in the semi finals. Well done, Kashua Resol. They performed well here and won this game. Overall, with a three all well the score overall is three all the first leg ended one all but here